What's good, y'all? It's your girl Nancy again. Just trying to finish up from the last video, and I just finished up another one that was on the June 29th that was supposed to be posted up, but it didn't. So I'm gonna be posting. Hopefully, it goes through. But uh, anyways, though, here we go again. Now um, I'm gonna say this for all this amount that you seen on the last video. What am I going to use that money for? Obviously, you should know if you've been following me for a while. I'm going to be saving it for surgeries and for to get out this area I am in. And to basically start all over again. A fresh start, new life, all that good stuff. You feel me? So, total amount do I, I do need is 75k to start something new now why so high because it's gonna cost at least 10k to get everything straightened out for my living situation on transportation with the uber and lyft going back and forth to try to find a job have to pay um rent or whatever of where i'm at and um food obviously and who knows how long it'll be before I can find a job and plus I will need money for me to obviously in case anything happens so I just don't know so and how would I have this money transport would I bring with me in cash would I bring it uh, with me on the card would I bring it by check or how would I do it well, I will see if it's possible for me to just have it in a bank and I'll be able to go to another area and then have the same bank and be able to do it that way. Well, I can just go ahead, you know, where it won't matter. As long as it's like, you know, it's with the same bank but in a different area where I'd be able to still have where I have basically account here too because i'm with the same company in different spot where i have the same funds you know i don't know that so i would like to that be something be highly highly helpful for that situation like it'll save more than enough trouble i mean so anyways though uh yeah um basically that's what it is for that so for actually making more money from this i will actually be using some of this too like i told y'all on one of my videos that i was wanting to get into invest investing and stuff like that with the stock market and all and that is something everybody should be doing and that's what people talking about on youtube on these fucking shitty ass ads talking about buy my book buy this and that oh you can quit your job oh i was doing this and that making this and that much oh this prayer shit they be doing and oh this and that blah blah i came for oh now look at me i'm living in this i'm doing this i got this many cars that, that because most of them are either being paid to say that shit or most of them are scam artists and a good few of them, not many, but a few of them, I say about maybe 6 or 16% of them are investors who invested in itself into making more. Now, you could either do this on your computer or by phone with the apps they got where you can invest into the stock market or whatever, but it's going to depend on what app you're trying to do and if it's free or if it's not for free. Either way it goes, it's going to make you money. Pay for it, you pay for it. You don't, you don't. Either way, it's going to make you money in the long run. As long as you know what you're doing, what you're going to be investing in, and how it's going to uh, benefit you, do it. I mean, unless you got some other ideas. But uh, for now, what I'm gonna do for business obviously I'm always gonna be a sale person so my business is gonna be selling all kinds of stuff like clothes electronics um, bikes 
and basically that would be about it including the other stuff and I'll be getting back into painting so that's going to be my business that's going to profit me and I'm going to be making this much with my first business I'm trying to get started this going to help me invest and invest into painting so yeah that's what I'm going to be getting started with now third thing would be getting back into selling bikes and clothes and all that stuff but that's going to take a good bit of money and it's going to take a website finding somebody to make a website for me now I ran into two uh, websites where you can pay people basically to make your website or whatever you're looking for and they'll do it for you for a certain amount and um, yeah so this way I'll be saving up for two and hopefully they can work with me where it would be easier for me to use and where I can add the track and add new items stuff like that or unless I will have to just keep in contact with them hopefully it won't be like that but if I do I do but that is something I don't want to do I don't want to do it on my own you feel me but if I can't you can't you know make it work but um now anyways though for that if I do get a website obviously I'm gonna be making thousands of dollars a day once my shit is actually out there my site is actually out there for the clothes and bikes and electronic and stuff could it be all in one in one section I have a different section one section for the electronics other section for clothes another section for bikes and you know like that's how I want my stuff organized that's how my site gonna be but yours could be different obviously and um uh, yeah but um anyways though and for my painting and stuff, obviously, that's going to be a local type of deal. And um, it'll be doing to my own base. I won't be hiring people on. This all will be all on me. This is going to be my own thing where I won't need no help. And I can take as many customers as I can handle and as I want. So, I want to work for nobody. I don't want to worry about dealing with no racism, no bullshit, no stupidity. I still will often here and there but not as much as working for somebody else like at a store restaurant big company factory building or whatever you know it'd be all on myself on my own terms and i can go wherever i want i can live wherever i want and make money and do the same thing but you just gotta look at how much it costs to live here and there for how long or what you plan on doing now, if you're planning on setting up a business, business where you painting and you got items, like big items you can't bring with you here and there, and then y'all look at that too. Either you sell everything and then you start first somewhere else and then you buy everything again or however you feel like doing, you know. So y'all look at that. It's pretty easy, simple. Just got to use your common sense and you can be happy as fuck and rich. On your own terms make as much as you want raise your own check up decrease your own check however you want to do it and have a savings account don't throw all that money away on jewelry and clothes save that money and flip it and double it buy houses buy trailers buy property or whatever and flip all that shit do whatever you think you can use to flip your money and keep it going and keep trying to do better than that like you don't got no limit keep it going so on that fact stay strong keep your mind focused stay away from negativity don't get in no trouble and just keep going don't matter what nobody stay I mean say and just keep studying about all kinds of shit you don't want to know about and find something else to add on to your business to make your life better and don't forget to donate and help out others who can't help themselves 
and give them the same knowledge to pass on.